Is there um, audience? <laughs> okay. Um, well, today the lesson I'm going to teach you is the equation of a circle. And so we're going to start off by drawing a coordinate plane. It's your x-axis and this is your y-axis. And we're just going to draw a circle anywhere on the plane. And then we're going to draw our center point right here. And we'll just call it C for center. And we'll say that the center is located at H, K. So, say H, K. It's an H. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> um, okay. And then we're just going to draw a radius from the center of the circle to any point on the circle. So that's a line that looks like that. And we'll say that the length of that line is R. Okay. And so then if you want to um, write the equation of the circle, all you have to do is x minus h, and that h is just that value right there, the x coordinate in your center, squared plus y minus k squared, and that k comes from right there, equals your radius squared. And that's your equation. <coughs> <coughs> and so then, say you're given a problem where you're given the center of the circle is at 1, 2, and your radius is equal to 2. To write your equation, you just do x minus, well, let's leave a little blank right here, squared <laughs> plus y minus, and leave another little blank, squared equals blank squared. And what value do you think goes in for H? The first one. Yes. Oh, one. Is one. one. <laughs> yes. <laughs> one. And what value goes in for K? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And what value goes in for R? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. And what's two squared equal? Four. Four. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, what if you are given the equation of a circle? X minus four squared plus y minus two squared equals 16. What can you tell me about the center of the circle? Four, two. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. And the radius is four. Yep. Allison, why is the radius four and not 16? Because you have to take the square root of mm -hmm. 16 to find it. Right. What if you're given an equation that looks like this? x plus 1 squared plus y plus 2 squared equals 9. Okay. It's a negative. Okay. It's a negative 1, negative 2. Yep. The radius is 3. Yep. Okay. Yeah. What if you were given center equals one, negative two, and what if I gave you the diameter at this time equals four? Oh man. Well, the diameter <coughs> is two radiuses, so you have to divide mm -hmm. the diameter by two. Okay. So the radius equals four, is that right? Which equals three. Mm -hmm. So your equation is x minus one squared plus y plus, plus, plus two, plus two <laughs> squared <laughs> equals what? Four. No, no, which is two four equals four. Ah, how am I on time? Got one minute. One minute. Okay. Um, would it be different if you changed to put the y equation in front of the x? Like, could you switch those? Could you do this? Yeah. What do you guys think? Same. Yep. Same. Yeah. Yeah. Because addition is addition. And what you might see if you get more advanced in this is sometimes they'll give you a problem where they'll give you this endpoint and this endpoint. And then you have to use the distance formula to, to figure out the distance in between there and then go from there. You might see that. 
later on. And then we do have to do the midpoint as well. Mm -hmm. Midpoint formula, sign you center. Yeah, very good. Um, <laughs> yeah, I couldn't tell you the midpoint formula. Can you tell me the midpoint formula? I know the midpoint Yeah. Okay. Can you tell me the midpoint? Oh, actually, oh boy. <laughs> I know it's square. It's e distance equals square root of. It's it's actually it's really uh -huh. similar, isn't it? It is. It's mm -hmm. just like x minus x one. Yeah, or x minus x1 squared plus y2. Yep, and what's the midpoint? Midpoint equals the coordinate, so it's x coordinate x1 plus x2 divided by 2. And the y coordinate is y1 plus y2 divided by 2. Great. And that's all.